All right, we have another self-resistant stretch, and this is going to be working around the shoulder. Some people might feel this um, laterally across the front of the shoulder through here. Uh, I particularly feel it from the front of the shoulder through the anterior head down into the bicep. Uh, this might come across, this might come down in the shoulder. All those things are going to be fine. Uh, you are going to feel it where you're the tightest. Uh, none of this should cause you any pain. Uh, you should not feel anything up through here, right? This would be compression because you'll see in the video as she's moving that uh, we're going to be moving the body down and away. And so this would be the area where compression would happen in the back of the shoulder. So this is the setup. We're going to get our hands on top of maybe the uh, kitchen table, something like that. Some good piece of equipment. We're going to have the abs in. Uh, the feet are in a stagger stance position. The hands are going to be pushing down and forward. Think of a sweeping motion, down and forward. And this is what she's going to also be doing with her knees and her body to go forward. So she is now lightly pushing down and forward. And she is dropping, bending the knees and pulling herself, especially off that front foot, pulling herself forward. And you can see that the torso, as the torso goes forward, the arms are stretched, going to be stretched backwards. And then, of course, with self-resistant stretching, when we feel the gentle end, we come back up and we get back in the a good starting position. Maybe change your hands or your foot position as you follow your intuition. And we are going to, the hands and arms are sweep, pushing down and forward in a sweeping arc. And notice that they basically follow the line of her hips and her torso. They're coming down and forward. And we are doing the same thing. And that's going to be a self-resistant stretch for the front of the shoulders. Thank you.